Okay, so there, there's going to be a little disclaimer at the start of this episode. This is going to be the finale of Persona 5 Royal. Um, obviously, uh, if you know anything, if you know how the last one ended. I am at the end of the game. This is my third time fucking doing this today. The first time I started, we lost power because our fucking breaker box fucked up. I don't know what happened, but whatever. Luckily, so ha half our breaker box is gone. Luckily, my room is still active, which is good. Now, the bad part. So, I started it up again. About halfway into the, that, into the recording, I realized I wasn't technically recording. I was just streaming. Which is fine. I don't care. Because I can just rip the video off from Twitch. However, at the fucking end of the goddamn game... My fucking internet cut. So, here's me doing this a third time. I know I'm recording. I'm not streaming because I don't have internet. Whatever. So, I'm going to say uh, some things again. I like... Which, I mean, obviously, you haven't fucking heard, but I have, like, four times now. I noticed this last time I was playing, at the very end. Um, I like how there is no music right now. Or anything leading up to this. Mm. Finally tamed to face Maruki. Be ready for anything. Hey. Maruki's finally coming. Make sure... Are you mentally prepared? However, you respond to Maruki. I trust you. I know you'll make the right decision. Um, fucking hell, I'm annoyed. This fight isn't hard, by the way. Sorry for the last minute visit. I will be quiet for a lot of this, though. How's Yoshizawa-san holding up? I've been concerned about a potential relapse, considering her difficulties with accepting this reality. I see. No, that's great news. So, getting down to business. I wanted to confirm with you one last time. Is there no other way to come to an agreement besides fighting? The reality I created may seem distorted from your point of view, but it's a reality where everyone is happy. If you just stay, you'll never have to suffer the pain of loss or the pain from having people and things stolen away from you. <sighs> so, you saw what happened with Rumi. I'm not the one who suffered. She is. But she's still living a wonderful life right now, in this world you call a distorted reality. But she still doesn't remember you, right? And you're fine with that? She may not be in my life anymore, but at least her own life is a happy one now. I'm not just doing this for Rumi. I want all of you to live just as happily as she is. But for Rumi's happiness to last, I have to move on. After all that's happened to her, to me, I just can't drag her into it. Doc. My stance will not change. Strange circumstances have led to my gaining this power. However, I now recognize it as being wholly inevitable. This is something only I am capable of doing. I promise, every person alive will be happy in the world I create. So, let me ask you the same. After really considering every option, do you have any doubts about your views? I suppose it's more accurate to ask, do you two gentlemen have any doubts? You're here, aren't you, Akechi-kun? Akechi! You caught me. Oh, it was just a hunch. This issue doesn't only affect you, Akechi-kun. This involves you, too. <sighs> what do these two have to do with... The relationship you two share is very unusual. A detective and a phantom thief. Despite being enemies, your relationship isn't based on hatred or ill will. 
He did hate me. That's why I found it so tragic when I learned what happened in Shido's palace. How did you learn this? You bastard! So, so, so. my final enemy is a puppet version of myself. I... Say, didn't you regret how things ended with him? You two came to a deep understanding of one another. Yet you had no choice but to leave Akechikun to his fate. That's why I created a reality where you two could have a fresh start together. <laughs> After all this, After all that's, this what that's what you have, you have to, say. to say. Seriously, you really are. That would mean the Akechi in the real world is... Get what I'm saying? I genuinely didn't want to tell you like this. I didn't want to make it seem like I'm holding him hostage. But no matter what you may think of me, I just want you all to accept this reality and move on with your happy lives. And that matters how, exactly? Don't tell me you think dangling my life before us is going to have any impact on our decision. Well, I lacked conclusive evidence. But after I fought against you all, I had a gap in my memory that ended with meeting up with him again. There were also the cases of Wakaba Ishiki and President Okumura. Of course, I'd find all of that suspicious. I see. I had a feeling the truth of the matter still wouldn't dissuade you, Akechikun. But how about you? You think dangling my life before us is going to affect our decision? That's what Akechikun said a moment ago. If that's how you see it at this point, I'm fine with it. But I'm still going to ask you, one last time, will you accept the reality I create for you? You were the guiding light to my research. You showed me the way so I could make my dream into reality. I have nothing but gratitude for you. Not a single ounce of ill will. That's why I wanted you of all people to understand. Perhaps I shouldn't ask you for an answer on the spot like that. I'll be going now. <laughs> like how he just tosses it. He ah, clearly does not right. want to do this. I've heard your calling. And about my question. Let's do this. I'll be waiting in the palace tomorrow. Just as I promised. If you still haven't changed your mind by then, we'll meet there. But if you don't show, I'll take that to mean you've accepted my reality. See you. What are you gonna do? <laughs> I'd like to speak with him. Akechi. Gotcha. I'll leave the decision up to you. Let me know when you've reached an answer. I will carve my own path for myself. I refuse to accept a reality concocted by someone else, stuck under their control for the rest of my days. All you have to do is stick to your guns and challenge Maruki. Or are you really so spineless that you'd fold over some bullshit trivial threat? He says this at all three fucking times. Then you already know what needs to be done. I want to hear you say it aloud. What do you intend to do? I literally just said I won't fold. I won't wait a moment longer. <laughs> I've given you answer my answer, me. Jackass. All right. I'm relieved to hear it. I will never accept this form of reality. I'm done being manipulated. Let's go back to our true reality. This is great. I 
feel so alive. Oh, so chaos as far as the eye can see. All right. Uh, Kachi's Persona Loki has transformed into your hair award. What's a life worth in a reality that was cooked up just to satisfy someone else? I say none. We have to win this. No matter what. I'm not going back now. Whoops. May decrease SP cost of ally support all my skills by half. This guy looks so fucking cool. Like, how is a compact bow? All right, we're all here. Those, like, it's time our final battle. Those, um, those, like, responses for the uh, fan site aren't set, they're not static, they, they change. Because the last when I did this, um, the last time I played through this, which again, about a fucking hour ago, the final message um, wasn't, are they even listening? It was, my dream already came true. Maruki came by LeBlanc last night, so we gave him the calling That's card. Neat. I doubt Maruki is still interested in discussion. You realize there's no backing out now, right? <laughs> Ain't no way we're gonna run now. We're gonna confront Doc in his palace, show him what's up, and go back to our own reality, right? Let's do this. Right. It appears we're all ready. It's time to take back what belongs to us. Our own reality. Summary of the story up to this point has been updated. I'm gonna do a few things real quick. I fucking love this song. Hold that thought for a second. I'm doing some shit. Does it follow you? Oh, damn it. I was hoping it followed you even in. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Oh, performing a feat to whom will you give birth? <laughs> Let me make say in. Make your selection. I can make Mother Harlot. Do you wish to fuse this? Fuck yes. The paternal figure of Christianity, Gabriel informed her that she was to be the mother of Jesus. Some sects revere her as the Virgin Mary, but others, the other denominations do not focus on her. Yep. Choose which skill to inherit. That'd be fucking stupid of me, wouldn't it? Why should we against fire? Babe. That's bad. Yeah, I don't know why, um... Oh, right, I don't have internet. Oh, wait, I might have internet. I'm so sorry. I fucking hate this goddamn game. <sighs> I can't believe this. Hold up.
I fucking can't make it. You wish to strengthen it. Did you change your mind? I'm making Anyone Maria. You wish to browse the entries. Persona is unknown. This game can fuck itself. Alright, who the fuck did I use to make Maria? Oh, it was Ishtar and uh one of the stars. Ishtar's a lover. You would you wish to summon this, you may take it with you then. Star, I think it's down here. Evil Power Star. You, you wish to summon this, you may take it with you then. A oh, whip performing a fusion. Make your selection. Do you wish to f choose which skill to inherit? Let's try this again, shall we? I was about to fucking lose my mind. I am Maria. Please allow me to become your master. Blah 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 blah. Hey, look, my internet's back up, so I'm gonna stream this a fucking again. I'm gonna drop Ishtar uh, one more time. Like, I'm gonna pull her out one more time. Because I know Ishtar is someone I used a lot last time. In the last time I fought. You, you wish to summon this, you may take it with you then. Again, it's not like I have the may luck be fucking on your money side. matters. to return. Yes. Indeed. Just god, I'm going to lose my mind. One last time. Here we go. <gasps> Fuck you. So Maria's level 99? Oh, right, yeah. Also, there was something I wanted to do last time. Legendary Saxon who opposed the Normans during the conquest of English in the 11th century. Said to have been the basis for tales of Robin Hood called Harroward of the Wit of Harroward the Way for his watchfulness. And if you think I'm delaying just to listen to this song, you're goddamn right I am. Do not fucking delay. Let's go! God, this song is so fucking good. I see you made it. 
Yep. Come on up. I'll meet with you at the center of paradise. Hmm. Okay. Well, we can finally move on now that we've got some stairs. What's that mess? Right. I... I'm not gonna lie. Once you pass through here, we won't have any choice but from Joker. Earth. Are you ready? Absolutely. Yes. Alright, let's do this. I wish it fucking made you just walk the entire way. I do, I seriously wish it made you do that. Let's go. We're all ready, let's do this, Joker. Try exercising some patience this time, all right? No way is that happening. <laughs> I think everything will be all right. It's basically the same as we always do. We can see the top now. We're on the stair. It'd be nice if everyone had a little chat there. The apple's being eaten. Thank you for coming. And something. It looks like I have your answer. Indeed. No more hesitation. I picked I'm sorry last time because I feel like Joker would legitimately be sorry. He told me not to pity him, so. Let's begin. If you win, my heart will be changed. However, if I win. My reality becomes the true reality. I will overwrite all of existence with my own cognition. I'm not holding back anymore. W what the? Just as you have your own beliefs, I too have no intention of changing my plans for reality. No matter what happens to me in the end, I will fix this torturous world. That is my own rebellion. Is apparel just... And I believe you called forth your power like this. Persona. I fucking hate this guy's look. Sorry, it's such a stupid look. He really does have a persona. I'd regret not pointing this out to you. You shouldn't mistake our powers as being equal. It's time, Azatha. Our final battle has come. My persona guides me. All right, let's go. God, this is gonna be such a fucking pain in the ass to redo. Doctor Maruki. To do this. Incoming guys, get ready. What I what I like about this fight is this isn't Yeah, this is a fight of like the world. But like Alright. At the end of the day, this is a fight of ideology over everything else. That's one down. Go clean. The persona protected him? This persona's definitely trouble. Yep. And for some goddamn reason, this fuck why? Never baton pass. I don't know why. I. He survived that every other time. What the fuck? It got a death wish. I would have fucking left if Crow just fucking shit again. 
<laughs> Persona. Not dealing with this fucking shit, dude. Go down. You have it almost one? Okay. Alright, no right, again, no idea why the fuck he just got ran. Yeah, and you should baton pass to me. What the fuck? Make this quick. What the hell? Persona. Whatever. Persona. I have no idea why Chrome does not, does not baton pass. <laughs> it doesn't make any goddamn sense to me. Here I go. Speed up. Let's go. There. Knocked him right off their feet. Nice, Joker. Go ahead. Not I'll try. Right. The baton has powered you up, Agnes. We've almost won. Pass the baton and I'm kind of upset Joker goes first. Because if Joker didn't go first, I'd rinse this guy. This is a new fucking attack. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I'm aware. Ravage that! Knocked him right off their feet. Nice, Joker. Go. All right, looks On like my turn. turn. Okay. All right. Nice time. I'll return the favor. Persona. Let you see. I can't remember what's wrong and guns won't help. Be careful. Strong and impervious oh. to nuke is a powerful enemy. Finish it quickly. Strong and a physical strength. Brute force won't work strong. Weak to physical growth. Oh, good. I do not, for the life of me, 
understand. It hopes we can it's strong and guns won't help. Be careful. Let's dance! Bernadette! Good job, Violet. It's all you. Then, yes. you. The baton pass powered you up. Zona! It's strong. Weak to physical. Strong and immune to physical strikes? Brute force won't work. I'll use my yeah. persona. <laughs> The enemy is strong. Let's Damn it. Where? What the Zona. fuck is this? Nice. God damn shit. Is it because I'm not knocking things down again? <laughs> it's tough. Queen, your attack's been lowered. Why didn't you do that? Not bad. Huh. I'm so confused. So let's move on. I have no idea. Persona. It's time. Hmm. They can't do anything. Persona. All right, fuckwad. Let's play that one. Let's play that one. Secret. I've been charged up. Right. For so goddamn long. If you pass the baton, you can hit the foe's weaknesses. Yeah, I'm not here. Like my turn. Strong and immune to strong and impervious to nuclear attacks. That looks like it hurt. Whatever. Am I fucking stupid? So stay on guard. I should have healed. Crow's got some moves. Hey! I'm glad that rock for once. Crow's got some moves. Neat. <laughs> Why did he get four fucking things? Akechi-kun, don't throw away your life. You're with him and his friends. You can begin to atone for what you've done. Enough of this high and mighty bullshit. Look at the contrast. Persona! Oh. This isn't it. I'm not exactly getting anything good out of this turn. It's tough. Maria. Hmm. Thank you so much. I'll use my persona. I think I'm gonna get a catchy out of here. Hm. Huh. I won't lose. Switch. I'll take the four. He's just too. I don't know why the fuck I'm not getting contact with him. Strong. 
Can't pass the time. That didn't work, right? God damn it. It's fine. No, oh, okay. Detox works. Just odd, oh, no. you don't attack him ever. Hey. Oh? This is our chance! Pass the baton! Do it! Power Queen, on into that! It's a powerful enemy. Finish it quickly with curse attack! Persona! Go, Agnes! Not bad. Absorb that. Oh, Maria Drain. Support's on the way. Kitagawa kun, I know you don't really want your approval to be earned through force. You want a world guided by beauty, and I can give you such a world. have my friends by my side in this world. I don't need another world forced upon me. And then you're here? Oh, that's tricky. This isn't it. It's a powerful enemy. Finish it quickly with Kirk. It's powerful. You'll want fierce ice attacks. Persona! I'm gonna try something tricky here. Is it gonna work amazingly or poorly? Fuck, that one's still alive. Get him! Get him! Strong and impervious to nuclear attacks? Let's go! Dazzle up, Bonadi! This is my other self! Out of the way! Why can I not put Tom Pass? This fight would be fucking over if I could. What the hell is going on? Oh, I've been able to baton pass from this before. From like down to enemies before. <laughs> God damn, such an annoying fight. Come. Some other way. Persona! Huh? Knocked him right off your feet. Nice, Joker. Go ahead. Not I'll help yet. you. Persona! Okay. Thank you. I appreciate it. Persona! Admit! Mm -hmm. I don't know why I'm not getting. Let's 
400 is going to take for fucking ever at this point. I need to get Ren to attack that fucking thing. <laughs> Yoshizawa san, that pain you're suffering, it must be impossible to move on. I want to save you from that awful life. I am myself. I'll never forget that again. It's time. That's not right. One, two, three. Persona! All right. Thanks. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Down. Go down. Go. I've got it. I'm the next. I am thou. Two. It's a powerful enemy. Finish it. The enemy is strong. Let's Let go. Aim for its wing weakness. Get them. Get the baton pass. Nice. Zona. This is a hell of a gamble, honestly. You're mine. Not bad. Not bad. Persona! I am thou. Wipe them out, Gorokichi! Persona! This is my soul! Damn it! And regenerate! <laughs> this fight's so fucking... I fucking... The annoying part is I've done this before. But I can't for some goddamn reason... ...do it again. I I guess I just don't understand. Wipe them out, Korokichi! You got him, Fox! One enemy hit the ground! Lend me a hand! Sure. On to the next! Let's go! You're mine! It's not bad! Persona! And we're gonna heal How Fox! Much thanks! What is being... Alright. What is being... Oh, Repelled. <laughs> Persona! Ah, oh, god damn it. Oh. Not this. Oh. Don't use any ice skills. Be careful here. Come! Okay. It's tough. 
There. I appreciate it. I'll return the favor. Who's that? Your make him pay. Persona. What is powerful enemy? Finish it quickly with curse attack. The opponent is strong. It's powerful. You'll want fierce ice attacks. I'll use my persona. This could be tough. Less skills will be nullified, so it's powerful. But guns should shut it down. It's a powerful enemy. Finish it quickly with curse attacks. It's powerful. But guns should shut it down. Just watch your ammo. That's one down. Go clean, go! I need to do I need to do this in a very specific order. Strong and impervious to nuclear, it's powerful. You'll want this could be tough. Plus skills will be nullified. So that's one down. Go queen go! Persona! Go, Agnes! <gasps> I wish. Persona. You got him, Fox. One enemy hit the ground. Get the Not here yet. Okay. Persona. Pass your power even higher. I'm gonna do this, and I fucking guarantee you, I'm gonna get a fucking contest out of this. Not bad. Oh, thank God I didn't. Suffer to realize it. I will use all of our power. Oh, okay. What the? What are they doing? Be careful. I'm sensing a ridiculous amount of energy from his persona. Joker, you all have to guard this. <laughs> once again, I'm. Well, once again. Again, I've already been through this, which is why I'm very annoyed, but. Nijima-san, everyone has the right to wish for I'm a happy family. I'm glad this game's very ambiguous on what I want you to do. You don't need to keep holding back your desires. I'll fulfill my desire for a happy family with my own power. And you fucking die if you don't buy this. Unable to use items? Oh man, I fucking... What is... Travesty, what the fuck do you mean I'm dark in this? Maria. Maria. Hmm. I appreciate it. Much thanks. I appreciate it. Persona. Let's go. This is my other self. Oh, I'm gonna do popping some SP all. If I'm right, he's not gonna heal. He's not gonna use regen. Don't use regen. Don't use regen. The enemy is 
strong. Let's aim for its wind weakness. The opponent is strong. Your enemy is strong. Let's aim strong and immune to physical strikes. It's a powerful enemy. Finish it quickly with curse attacks. Persona! No, can't do that. Persona. Shitsune! All right. This is gonna be one hell of a setup, and I'm very much expect myself to fuck this up. The enemy is strong. Let's aim for its wind weakness. No wind skills. It's powerful, so stick. It's immune to curse. I had hoped we could end this quickly. It's strong. Okay. Hold up. I. We just need to use that. Strong and impervious to nuclear attacks? That's ice. It's immune to curse. Strong and immune to physical strikes? Brute force won't work. Okay. This is going to be one hell of a gamble. But I need to do this in a very specific order if I want this to work. Okay. No. I need her to attack regularly, right? You know what to do, right? Strong and immune to physical strikes? Brute force won't work. And we know their weak points now. Pass the baton! Ice. Nuke. Strong and immune to physical strikes? Brute force won't work. It's a powerful Shit. enemy. Shit. Finish it quickly. I Strong fucked and up. immune to physical strikes? Brute force won't work. I didn't realize this guy was strong against new people too. It's powerful. You'll want fierce ice attacks. Oh. Please, help me not even attack. Persona! Right. I forgot I had a solo new tech. It's just. It's almost won. Pass the baton and switch it. It's such a fucking hard gamble. Let's go. Heavy to all, heavy to one. If kill it, kill it, kill it. You got him, Fox. One enemy hit the ground. Yeah. It's up to you. Okay. Pass the baton. That was strong and immune to the opponent is strong. Come, Don't whatever. do anything reckless. This is still gonna do a fuck ton. Not bad. Yes. I finally figured it out. I think I skipped a phase. I legitimately think I skipped a phase with that. As I thought, did I fail? Is that? Yes, that is my name. It's me. How are you doing? It's Maruki's treasure. <laughs> Your friend. Maruki's treasure? What Good. is it though? A what torch? Is it? Torch is a light to guide people. It may symbolize his perception of himself as the guide for the entire world. We're here to change his heart, aren't we? Go on. Take it. <laughs> Fun fact, this is not the final part of this one. So, this is it. It is. This place is collapsing! We'd better take our leave. For me. I'm sorry. I couldn't. No, I... I can still... Joker, look out! Oh, shit. Garrett, <laughs> we gotta book it. I like how he looks at his god. Fuck. Guys, jump in! Yeah. Yeah. Hang on! Whoa. No, no, 
I wonder how much of this is Makoto and how much of it is Morgana. Okay. Regardless, I'm done with the heavy shit. That was close. Dr. Maruki. This has gone too far past changing someone's heart. Is he even still alive? Looks like that isn't a concern. Did you just like fucking sense his life force? What the hell? How did you know Sorry, that? Sorry, but I won't admit defeat just yet. Oh, because why would you? I'm sorry. You know I can't do that. I've been chosen by the world itself. Granting this wish is my responsibility. Yeah, I'm on par with where I was last time. Oh, now we're in. Now oh, shit. The hell? What would have happened if Joker just held on to it? Would he been dragged with him? He just. The treasure. I'm sorry. I forgot there's a long gap there. I'm tired. I want this game over with. Yeah, you know, this is still gross. But damn, this is such a good song. This is some fucking Attack on Titans bullshit now. No, you can't be serious. Maruki, he's done it. He evolved his persona. Yep. Such strength of will. If it is for everyone's happiness, I don't care what happens to me. Don't resist. Accept it. With my power. No. With mine and Adam Catamon's together, our reality is nigh! I refuse to let it end like this. God, this song is so good. Cadmon, guide us all to our ideal reality. I said this in shock last time, but because of holy shit, Sam Cadmon. Was expecting this. I think Adam Cadmine is. I think he is like the ideal human in like Jewish lore. It's really fucking confusing. Yeah, we refuse to let it end any other way too. Persona. All right. Damage to Maruki is greatly reduced. All right. Yep. It is so greatly reduced. I'm probably about to one shot this man. Persona. This is my other self. Persona. Victory is ours. Well, I'm not gonna one shot, but. Joker's about to fucking show this man what for. Persona. There. Not bad. Told you. I still can't do it. And my reality is right before my eyes. I totally did skip a phase last time. I'm sorry. Hold up. So in the first fight, we, um, when he has the tentacles, and you have to knock him down in a very specific order, and then go after whatever the fuck the persona is called. I don't know what the fuck I did last time different from this time, but oh, I know. I think this time I managed to knock both him and the persona down at the first time at the same time. 
but I think the idea is you knock the pers- you knock out the glo- uh the hands or claws or whatever the fuck it's called. Go after the persona, and then the persona gets knocked down, and then you bum rush Maruki. I think I skipped that final part. I think I managed to kill him and the persona at the same time. So I skipped that. I said I didn't care what happened to me. But I lied. But I guess... I wasn't committed to my words. You too, huh? Why are you allowed to use your persona with your mask on? Cross-senpai, what are you... Can't you tell? Ah, that's what you get for using a toy, fucker. You think the same thing, don't you? Of course you do. After all... No, you can't! We hesitate right now. We die. He said hesitating. Up there! Is he about to get eaten? All right, I guess I wasn't exactly wrong. This is just fucking Devil May Cry Four. Use me, however you want. Where the hell's Dante and you? Now, need them? show us the reality, the reality we wish for. All right. Getting tired of this white light bullshit. I am thou, and. Oh, fuck. No. What? Oh, no. For some odd reason, Joker doesn't get knocked down to 1 HP. And so he's just standing here like a boss. It's so good. This power is the source and the destination. I will be the light that guides mankind. But we are still not going to run. We're going to beat you and go back to our own reality. This is such a good one. No. Okay, it's fun fight. fact. Um, this fight's over, but Alright. Interestingly enough. Thank you. Thank you so much. You opposed that What? It's not working at all. Nope. <laughs> no good. Joker, try something else. Joker hasn't moved yet. Nothing works. Now, I'm not sure you can attack during this, so I'm just gonna guard. It's it's seriously guard when he's in the face of guard. It is very much that first that first part of this fight is the hardest. Once you pass that, you pretty much have lost. If this doesn't stop, I'm gonna try to find a way to get us through this. Just hang in there for a few more seconds. I think that means like two more. Come, all right. But no, this this game is over. Whoops, I meant to attack there. You might not even be able to my spirit this fucking guard the entire time. Just heal and guard, honestly, my dear. Guard. Guard. Oh, man. 
Only, only if you could evade this attack. The time to end such strife is at hand. No. The cat just blasted with the fucking ass paw. God damn, I'm getting tired of these white lights. Luckily, I've only seen this twice. What? We've come this far. We ain't gonna give up. Yeah. You gotta do way better than this. They're all using this to stone us. Hey, those are those are sounds like just things. another threat. We'll overcome it like we always do. If I run now, I know I'll regret it. We'll decide for ourselves what we want our lives to be. I'm a bit occupied, so do your goddamn job! Oracle, how does it look? Perfect! His head's defense level has dropped down to zero percent! Go for it! Finish this, Joker! <laughs> goddamn, I'm mad I have to do this twice, this is so goddamn cool! Oh, fuck, we end up here. Why? I'll take this back. I gave up everything else. I dedicated all that I have to this. But I still... Why? You mean... I'm running away from it all? <laughs> you nailed it. It's true that I turned my back on the original reality. But where's the harm in that? When it grows to be too much, too painful, every person deserves to escape that. <sighs> in all honesty, it's best for a person's growth when they tackle their own hardships. But reality doesn't always make that so feasible. No matter how much you try or work for so long, the smallest injustice can wipe it all out, leave you with nothing. Don't you of all people understand that? You know, there probably are plenty of people who'd ultimately benefit from your reality. But what about the people who want to take on the world themselves? How is it right to rob them of their opportunities? I don't think what you're saying is wrong either, Dr. Maruki. Some people want to run from their pain, and cling to some other version of reality, like I used to. But the knowledge I gained through that pain, and my desire to move on, those are even more precious to me, and I won't let anyone take them from me again. <gasps> Yoshizawa-san. So you truly don't want it, huh? Looks like I'm totally finished.
Oh, that's not good. The palace is collapsing! Dr. Maruki, hurry! It's not safe there! Dr. Maruki! No! It's too late for him! We are trapped as well! Huh? Is there any way? Everyone! Get over here! Hurry! <clears throat> this is some of the dumbest shit. This is about the time where my internet cut. Like, right after this. Monotan, what are you? And so I gotta admit, this is some of the dumbest shit ever. And it's so fucking stupid, I love it. This is no time to act tough! Whoever said it was an act! Mona Senpai, can you fly? But I'm a car! There's no way I can. No. It's now or never. I have to fly! <laughs> Like, it's, it's so fucking stupid. It's a fucking cat helicopter. How does this even work? A helicopter? If you could do this, then say so, damn it! Well, I didn't know! Now I'm downright priceless to the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt your little moment of triumph, but couldn't you have made yourself just a bit larger? Hey, where'd Joker go? Don't worry. He's like, I'm not fucking sitting in there with all of you. I'm gonna enjoy the view. <laughs> Akechi's just like, God damn, I wish I was there. Got another grappling hook so I can kind of chill out. God damn it. Sorry to cut your flight short like that. Asshole. This place is done for, along with the entire reality I dreamed of. I have lost. Even if I were to try that fight over, I'm sure I'd only lose again. You would, because I fucking did it twice. So I know, this is going to sound pretty stupid. I've been holding this all in for so long, just hiding it for myself. So, please, help me kill every last one of my regrets. You're the only one I can ask to help me with this. disappearance of my palace of the entire metaverse is drawing near it'll be back seems like neither of us can summon our personas anymore let's begin i gave up everything everything so why Reality where no one suffers. Game. Well, Tech 
you want to be, don't think you. Okay, sad. There's still probably an hour left of this fucking game, by the way. I'm done. I get it now. All thanks to you. I'm done. Please, let go of my hand. Your eyes are as bright and honest as ever. They are the dullest fucking color in this you game. You keep your head up no matter what. I must have always been afraid. Afraid you and I wouldn't wish for the same reality. So bright. God damn it, why the fuck am I here again? <laughs> Magnificent! We have indeed witnessed your decision. Not only have you taken back mankind's future for itself, but you've also re-established our reason for existence. While reality had been wholly distorted, your actions have guided it back towards what it ought to be. Mm. That is correct. Time itself cannot be rewound, but every past event will revert to the event that should have occurred instead. We should have occurred, occurred instead. I'll ask you once more. Oh, I'm going back to prison. I'd like for you to turn yourself into the police, of your own accord. I will carve my own path for myself. I refuse to accept a reality concocted by someone else, stuck under their control for the rest of my days. <laughs> Everything will return to how it should be. Everything. There are no exceptions. Have your regrets begun? I see. Choosing such a path must not have been easy for you. For that, you have our utmost respect and gratitude. Mona, Akechi-kun, and he be. We've literally looked everywhere. This is our original reality, right? I believe so, yes. The meta-nav is gone. We don't even have a way to check anymore. At any rate, there's no point in worrying about it here. We should work all of this out somewhere else. You're right. Now that I think about it. We've been out all night, too. So let's go to LeBlanc. 
It's the paper say. So we went, we went to prison anyways, because the catchy wasn't there to fucking. Hmm? I'm home. You didn't tell me you'd be out all night. We didn't think we would be. You should have at least gotten in touch with me about it. I'm sorry, Sojiro. We're the ones who kept her out so late. We should be apologizing for her. And we're all back so early in the morning. We're awfully sorry. Stop apologizing so much. Being worried isn't exactly on my list of favorite activities, but I assume you had a good reason for it, right? Yeah, man. Um, have you seen him at all lately? The story we have to tell. Uh, him? What are you bringing him up for? Do you know what his deal is right now, Sojiro? Well, yeah. He's been locked up since last year. Locked up? What's going on? What are you guys talking about? Well, I was gonna ask you that, but now I'm getting a strange feeling that I've been seeing him until fairly recently. Anyways, why don't you all take a seat before I go over his situation? Man, let me tell you some stories. So, he's in juvenile detention? Well, I need to stock up on a few supplies before I open up shop. Feel free to hang out here while I'm out. Thank you. So, this is our original reality, right? Or are we in another different one now? You know, these unexpected changes could actually be the end results of our actions in our own reality. Remember how he was originally planning on turning himself into the police? Then Akechi-kun did it for him instead. But that took place in Dr. Maruki's reality. Which means he's currently... So everything that would have happened if it weren't for Dr. Maruki... Now it's actually happened? You know, what y'all are saying is starting to make sense. But in that case, in the real reality... Uh, I, I mean, the reality we're in right now. What happened with Morgana and Akechi? Don't say it. Just like with my mom. No more Ghanas. Did someone say my name? This again? <laughs> Recycle gags suck! Why do you always have to get us all worried like that? <laughs> oh god, the game is becoming self-aware. How are you here? Looks like it really was just the metaverse me who disappeared. Eventually, I woke up in Shibuya. Getting all the way back here took some time. Come on, don't scare us like that. Oh, uh, but wait, does that mean Akechi's... What is it, Mona-chan? Well... About him... No... I can't believe Akechi-san's really... What the hell? So he was fighting that hard, knowing he was gonna disappear the whole time. So he's incarcerated... And Akechi is... I thought I'd braced myself for the decision we made, but... This truly is a harsh reality. We all decided to live our real lives and look to the future from here. But even so... I... I just can't accept Senpai being stuck behind bars. Why don't we try to help him somehow? Nice. I'm impressed with the idea. Yeah. We won't put up with this injustice. But what can we do to actually help him get out of there? I remember Sis telling me a while ago, in order to overturn a sentence, you need definitive evidence that proves the subject's innocence. So what you're saying is, we just gotta find that evidence, right? Then we're on the case. There's no time for us to waste. We're going to show off what the Phantom Thieves are capable of. One last time. Remember, Scramble still exists. That's right! Let's go! We're gonna save our leader no matter what it takes! Yeah. Really? Now that we know the name, all we need is an address. You're right. 
We'll succeed if we all do it together. Sis has yet to say anything, but I believe she's looking into possible actions as well. As for me, I will look into every viable solution. Thanks. Make sure you give my regards to Shiho-san. Oh, could we try getting their help as well? I'm sure they would gladly cooperate. Hold up. That would be a great help. I'll leave that to you. The name I needed to see to realize who the fuck it was. We'll talk again tomorrow. Let's save him. No matter what. I'll announce his name as the key figure in the completion of the medicine at the next conference. I've heard that Miwa-chan's progress is going well. Indeed, that's true, but... I'm certain that this will help prove his good character in the trials. Please, I want to increase his chances of being found innocent as much as possible. I see, so that's why. <laughs> You'll cooperate too, right? And so we need to release an official opinion from this school to object his arrest to the police. You'll all agree with me, correct? What good are teachers if they don't believe in their students? Like, fucking four of you know I'm awesome. The rest of you can get fucked as far as I'm concerned. P please, I, I beg of you. Please help me collect enough signatures. I, I want to help a friend who's innocent. You are literally talking He's to someone. He's a really good guy. He always fights for the sake of others. He's... He's my best friend! So basically, the reason why we were able to come to our senses is because he saved us. And now he's in a crisis himself. I believe it's our turn to save him this time. But our words alone won't reach anyone. That's why I need Yokota-san and everyone's help. Won't you please protest the police with me? Please! Please tell me if you know of this young man. I need testimonies from people to use in the special article in regards to him. Did he truly look like a boy who would cause an assault here? There's a discrepancy in the other residents' testimonies in the court decision at the time. Please, you have to remember. Look at the guy ranked number one in these rankings. Isn't his score amazing? <laughs> Everyone's doing all this like investigation because like fucking guy knows how to play a video game, right? I really want to go up against him, but I heard he's been arrested for some crime he didn't commit. But I can't help him out with just myself alone. We need tons more people's voices, like on online forums and getting signatures and stuff. You have to say with me that it makes no sense that he's been arrested when he's done nothing bad. I've broken several crimes. Please, please help him out. Isn't that the king behind him? <laughs> Is that just Reeves model? Yes, it's thanks to that young man. I would still be trapped in that awful match fixing if not for his support. And now. This honest gentleman is locked up in juvenile hall, despite being innocent. The if you get the uh, arms dealer uh, thing up, <laughs> all he doesn't do any of this. He just talks to somebody knows he's like, make sure this kid doesn't get fucking hurt. <laughs> Juvie, it's like whoa. This time, I wish to be the one to come to his rescue. doesn't belong in juvenile detention at all. I swear I'll make up for the mispractice. Please, let me take just a short break. Uh, coach? 
No deal. Oh no. But I've got a few connections up my own sleeve that'll probably be more useful than simply doing your own legwork. I'll also try calling around to check if any of my other trainees have some useful info. But if I do this for you, it means you're continuing practice as scheduled. Got it? I'm sure it's what he'd want for you too. Oh, she's yeah, hell yeah. Thank you so much, coach. Hell yeah. Let's take a look. He'd want this, but can we not just talk? I'm getting fucking tired of waking up here, dude, you know? You escape the prison of the heart only to be imprisoned in reality. What a most ironic outcome. Your wish for others' happiness prevailed over your own. However, I feel as though all is finally well. In the end, you willingly chose the correct path. Most importantly, you never compromised your values for your own well-being. The final arcana you have acquired is the world. It is the power for an individual to stand on their own two feet, swayed by none. That power shall fuel the hope shared amongst your friends and yourself to strive towards a better future. With the world, you are no longer without a place to belong, and will never trudge a path alone again. Neat. My own duties end here as well. You were truly a remarkable guest. Oh god, he's vanishing. Oh god, she's vanishing. The butterfly. Long time no see. So we met last on Christmas Eve, right? Uh, it, never mind. It, it's nothing. I have two great pieces of news for you today. First, we finally managed to prosecute Masayo Shishido. He'll likely be found guilty. All right, she I'm does grateful something. for your cooperation with the trial. Your testimony proved to be very useful. To be frank, it seemed almost hopeless at one point. But thanks to the civil protests, some of the more indecisive prosecutors came to our side. It will likely be some more time until the hearing begins, but this is the first step to true change. The only charges right now are for breaking election laws, breaking funding control laws, and bribery. Mm. I knew that proving the metaverse's existence would be difficult, but I still find myself dissatisfied. Shido did admit to all of his crimes, though, including everything you know about. Yeah, which means at some point just gonna be like, all right. Now for the other piece of good news. As of today, You'll be free to go. Fuck yeah. Yeah, why so sudden? Shido's confession brought light to the truth of your case. We were able to prove your innocence in the original assault charge that led to your arrest. Your sentence will no doubt be rescinded. You're a free man. The others did everything they could for you. Bringing in the woman who was the victim in your case as a witness was the turning point. To think they'd be able to track down someone involved in a case from well over a year ago. That wasn't all. An unbelievable amount of support has come in from various other places as well. Yeah, I've been busy since I've been here. Regardless, the righteous phantom thieves are gone. All that remains is for us adults to lead society in the right direction. Yeah, try not to fuck it up. We've seen what happens that Then again, I have to wonder if you believe what I say. <laughs> I trust you, sort of. Thank you. Still, I'm glad I was able to save you in court. I've never felt so happy in my entire life. I'm not quite sure how to put it, but saving your future meant more to me than my own career. I feel like you even taught me how to live. 
<laughs> that wasn't my intention. <laughs> that's not true. It really wasn't. By the way, there's something that's been on my mind. What did the treasure of my world turn out to be? I wish... I wish you could put... We never saw it. I suppose it doesn't matter now one way or the other. Because they didn't. They never saw it. There is... One more thing. I haven't even told Makoto about this. But I realized something after meeting all of you. My most prized treasure is the justice I use to protect those important to me. Makoto helped show me that as well. Once the Shido case is settled, I'm thinking of quitting my job and becoming a defense lawyer. I wanted to reform the system, but I'll have to leave that to someone else. Going forward, I want to enact justice not for myself, but for the sake of others. <laughs> well then, I need to go submit the paperwork for your release. Thank you again for everything you've done. See you later. <laughs> Thanks for the bag. And my clothes. Are these walk? Hey, you kept me waiting. Jeez. To be honest, I didn't really want to come. But Futaba just wouldn't stop bugging me. Anyway, you're a free man now, aren't you? Hell yeah. <laughs> And it'd look bad on me if you did something again under my watch. <laughs> All right, let's go home. It's cold, so get in quick. This fucking game, I, I tell you. It's not moving at all. It's like the first day. Due to the railway incident this morning, widespread delays have impacted the various lines and... Again? Another accident, huh? <laughs> Reminds me of that day back in April. Remember when we went to introduce you at the school? I'm trying to forget. <laughs> you never change, huh? Thinking back, that was pretty awful to you. Throwing you in that storage room all by yourself. And again, soon you're gonna be... Made some great friends here. You better thank them when we get back, all right? Fuck yeah, have to go to like 20 different locations. Be like, hey, thanks. Oh god, why is it always white fucking lights? Woohoo! Namaste! What the fuck? <laughs> Whoa! You did it! It has been a while. Not bad! You look fine! It's been like 10 days! I'm glad you seem well! And the best for last, me! <laughs> the cat exists. So we meet again. It's good to see you. <laughs> Here. All right, so let's grab a table. I gotta head out and grab some groceries. I'm sure you guys have plenty to talk about. Not really. Like I said, we've been gone for 10 days. Now we're only missing one last person. She texted me a little while ago that she's finished with practice and heading here. I'm hmm. guessing she'll be here any minute now. Sorry I'm late. Senpai. What's up? Um, Welcome back. All right, that's everyone. Come on, Sumire, take a seat. Man, it went well, yeah? I'm so glad we didn't give up. This was certainly worth the effort. We didn't know what to do once you were gone, but then we realized something. <laughs> Did a lot of fucking work in 10 days. Even if we don't have the metaverse or any other special powers, <coughs> we can still change reality. They had like fucking two months the first time. If we didn't do that at the very least, we'd be betraying the entire reason we stood up to Maruki. No, they had three months the first time, I think. We'll oppose the injustices of this reality with our own strength. That's what we all what agreed the upon. Fuck. Hold up. Ever since then, 
We've been doing just that. That's the calculator. Busting our asses trying to get you out of the clink. Hold up. Not just us. Everyone who believed in you joined us. Oh, no. Thanks to that, we've got our leader back. Yeah, they had ten fucking days to do this at one time. Hmm. <laughs> Took you long. I'll be an asshole. Sorry, man. We were trying real hard, you know? They treated you fine, right? Actually, did you lose some weight? It would be understandable. I've heard the food in prison is quite foul. So, what did you eat? Was it bugs? Fermented mackerel? Or maybe durian? No. You're missing the point. <laughs> eh, you're gonna get some good food soon enough, though. Boss is out getting stuff for our party right now. Come on, everyone's back together. It's time to celebrate. <laughs> I guess you really were hungry. Fuck yeah. He's like, no, that wasn't oh, me. Oh, that wasn't you? Sorry about that. Oh, it was Sumire. Sojiro will be back soon. Just hang in there. Oh, yeah. Uh, sorry for not minding my business. What? But we heard from boss. You're going back home next month? Yeah. Can't you stay here? Sure, we proved you're not guilty, but people are still gonna label you there, aren't they? Ain't no. it just gonna be uncomfortable going back? What's the matter? We were all so excited a moment ago. Ryuji opened his fucking mouth again. How about this? If our leader is leaving, the Phantom Thieves are truly disbanding, correct? Today, we can celebrate his release and commemorate the day of our disbandment. Give it a few weeks. Give it two months in <laughs> real life. What kind of commemoration is that? <laughs> I was serious when I said it. It sounds like a good idea to me. I guess you're right. We just gotta double our excitement for today. About that, there's something I need to tell you guys. I've decided to go with him when he leaves. He's pretty special after all. Oh, Plus, yeah. we need someone there in case he turns back into a delinquent. Fuck off, cat. Let me think it over. Come on, we've known each other long enough. You don't have to say that kind of stuff to me. Either way, I want you guys to add my farewell party to the one we're having tonight. I don't know. Is that important? <laughs> You're not leaving for another month, right? It is far too early for a farewell party. That'll just muddy the purpose of this celebration. Oh, how dare you! Sumire, at least you're on my side, right? Uh, me? <laughs> then, what say we call this a second round welcoming party? That's the ticket, my re-welcoming party. Nobody can complain about that. So, for the food at my party, I no. demand sushi! Sushi! Of course, got my sushi. What's up? Man, you guys are loud. I could hear you from outside. Deal with it. Chief, they're so mean. <sighs> Noisy as always. Hey, I'm not some normal cat. <laughs> I can't understand what you're saying to me, you know. Here. No, I would much rather have sushi than something like. Mm hmm? This is delicious! God, this cat. <laughs> what an assertive little guy. I wonder where he got that from. Ah, uh, he was always like that. <laughs> That's just part and parcel of who I am. The one, the only, Morgana. Stop trying to talk so big. You're just a cat now. Shut up! I don't need to hear that from some dumb ape. Oh, God. What was that? It's things like that. You get angry so fast. Oh, and you're vulgar. Fair enough. You little... Why don't you go disappear again? Shut up! We're supposed to be celebrating, not fighting! <laughs> They're at it again. You guys never change, do you? No, there's a man fucking Seriously, arguing with a cat. that weirdo Inari. <laughs> what the fuck does he do with this? Who are you calling a weirdo? Don't worry. Being weird is just a sign of your individuality. 
course. Uh, you don't need to defend him about that. <laughs> well, anyways, we're all here now. Let's kick this party off! Very well. Sojiro! I want sushi! Jesus. Delicious food, fluffy sheets. I guess home is what you make it, even in this abandoned building of all places. Hey, take care of me like this back home too, okay? All right. But seriously, I want to ask you something. Remember the tail end of Maruki's palace when I was actually flying? That wasn't a dream, right? Sure, it wasn't. Nice. Hey, I thought so. But I still can't figure out how it was possible in the first place. So this is just a theory, but don't you still have that star Jose gave you? Oh! Hey, it's Star lost its luster. This is shining. This was shining the last time you looked at it, right? So it really was the effect of the star. Oh well, of course it was. Now that I think about it. There's no other way that the idea of a cat can bring into a co helicopter could suddenly become a common cognition. Well, we're going we're, we're through the metaverse, and it only happened in the most extreme of emergencies. So I have to feel I have a feeling that won't happen again anytime soon. Are you home? If you're not, if there's nothing wrong with you, then let me come over and examine you. I'm just kidding. I just wanted to see. Can I come over tomorrow after work? What should I do tomorrow? Yeah, that's enough for it. Good to hear it. I'm looking forward to tomorrow. You never change, do you? Come on, let's go to bed. You're working at the shop from tomorrow onward, right? Am I not going to school anymore? The fuck? What was this? break, but whatever. Hold up, I'm Get something. Every day is so boring. Do you do the fan things really exist? About fifty, yeah. Still don't care about this. Right, today's Valentine's Day. No wonder there were so many guys bringing girls in here. Don't you have anything exciting happening? I mean, you've been here nearly a whole year. I missed one showtime. It's Joker and Violet because I didn't get her thing maxed out fast enough. Whatever. You know, when I was young, oh boy. Good evening. <laughs> Should I come back later? No. Oh, uh, you should have just told me. Here, I'll leave the store to you. Enjoy yourselves. Careful. You seem to be doing well. Futaba saw the fucking place bugged. <laughs> Sure. Yeah, I was in prison for two months. It was great. Oh. It's nice to see Ten you again. Days. You don't look like you've got any issues. That'll be fucking romantic. Oh, you should have seen this my shit. Line. Suicide in jail. Then New Year's in the reformatory. Ex post facto isn't exactly going to cover this, you know? Look, I've been through some Honestly. shit. Honestly. Can't take my eyes off you for a second, but I guess I'd better get to the point. Here. Fuck yeah. Chocolates. Don't worry, there's nothing too dangerous in them. I don't trust you. I don't care. In moderation, right? 
That new medicine for that girl I told you about has been working really well. You're only allowed to use it once, so he downs the entire fucking box in one and go. And the day-to-day -day work's going fine. I'm a regular neighborhood doctor now. Thanks. I just hoped you were safe. But looks like you made it home without a scratch. Guess I had nothing to worry about. You missed a shot Titan in the face with a gun. Something wrong? I see. Can I sit next to you? Fuck yeah. I know that look in your eyes. You've made up your mind. I haven't exactly. No rush. You can hold off until things settle down a little. But if anything happens, call me. You know how to reach me. By the way, something's different about you. Hasn't been too long since I saw you last, but you've got a little more confidence now or something. Still, I guess I've changed too. Let me tell you the month I've had. As a doctor, I've still got the usual obligations to help my patients, but now I feel like I've got something a little more specific. Like, I could risk it all to make one person happy. But you're a smart guy. I don't have to draw you a picture. I'd like you to. Ow! That was my wrist. I was never really into younger guys. I think that was like your effect. It's been a romantic year. Kami. Probably exist? I oh, don't know, I think so. God. At least have some confidence in your fucking answer. Perfect timing. You've got a guest. What's up? Sorry to bother you this early in the morning. I was wondering if you'd like this. There's no obligation, of course. What the fuck is this? You've helped me through a lot. I wanted to express my appreciation. Sorry for how this is coming off. I didn't mean for it to seem like I'm just dumping my leftovers on you. It's fine. I'm the one who should be thanking you. So, thank you. Also, apologize to your sister. Well, look at this hot shot. Lucky guy having a gorgeous lady drop by this early just to give you treats. You. I hope you don't mind that I stopped by today. No doubt you already got some from someone special. I do. I should really be going anyway. Sorry to impose. And this is hardly the end of my debt, of course. Chocolate isn't going to cover all you've done for me. See you around. Oh! What's up? I heard they finally turned you loose. I'm glad you're doing okay. I expected at least a phone call, though. I've been dealing with some shit, okay? Anyhow, you're free, and that's worth celebrating. <laughs> I was hoping I'd get a chance to hand this over, so this is good timing. You know how it was Valentine's Day yesterday? I'm aware. It's just a token of my appreciation, so don't go feeling guilty about not getting me anything. How about you consider it a sign of trust from one comrade to another? See ya! He's gonna beat Joker's ass after this. Fucking Christ. We usually don't run into each other here, huh? Oh, yeah. This is for you. I was going to give it to you at school, but as long as we're both here, have some chocolate. You know, for Valentine's Day. As friends? As friends. Close friends. I'll be counting on you. God fucking damn it. Great timing. I was just headed to your classroom. Honestly, if I knew this, I probably would have skipped a lot of take this. this. It's chocolate. Think of it as a token of appreciation for all you do for us. Hey, your sister gave me some earlier today. Don't worry about it. It doesn't have to be a big deal. This guy's gonna fucking smell like a goddamn Hershey's factory after this skip See you again day. soon, okay? I'm pretty sure I have- I'm pretty sure I hit- oh no, I missed oh, senpai. Futaba, but outside of her, I think I hit every female confidant right Sorry, pack. I didn't mean to ambush you like this, but this is yours, if you want it. It's 
chocolate, a token of my appreciation and respect. Well, when I put it like that, it sounds a bit too intense. Oh, please, don't worry about it. It's not a big deal at all. I just wanted to show you I really appreciate you putting up with me, and I hope that doesn't change. That's fine. Why is everyone giving me the goddamn chocolates? I thought it'd be best to wait until today. After all, if you got one from someone special, I wouldn't want to intrude. You always do so much for me. This is the least I could give in return. Are you sure I can have this? Of course. We should get coffee again sometime too. That one chick is looking very intensely at that talk, uh, whiteboard. Just let me know when you're free. Oh, I'm glad I got to see you. That's I'm enough. relieved you're safe. On that note, I have a small gift for the occasion, if you'll accept it. Apparently these days, people give chocolate to friends, even when it's purely platonic. Seems like a fine opportunity to celebrate your return, and express my gratitude. I hope Shogi brings us even closer together. Hello there. God damn. I knew you'd be here. Oh, I don't mean I've been watching you. I just read your fortune. Now that that's cleared up, please take this. It's to celebrate your freedom. And to say thanks for everything you do. If you ever need my power again, all you have to do is ask. I'll always be happy to help you. Anyone else? I know it's sudden, but could you watch the store? I gotta head out for a bit. Think you can keep an eye on things? Yeah. Oh, were you working? Sorry to distract you. I thought I'd stop by on the way home from work. Partly so I could give you this. Oh yeah, I did finish this off at You've the done end. so much for me, after all. I wanted to say thanks. Oh, and I didn't get to say it at work, but welcome back. I'm glad you're safe. Oh, right. I whipped up a little study guide for the classwork you missed. It should cover most of the important stuff. If you're still having trouble with any of it, you can always ask me, okay? I'm your teacher. That's my job. Anyway, I'll see you at school. Why are we stopping here? I'm free after school tomorrow. I should be available. Why? Someone want to talk about thinking we could all meet up at the block? Can you check if boss is free to run? Sure, that works for me. Me too, I can head over when school's over, I'll get here. Likewise, then let's head there as we can. Yep, see you guys there. Reggie wants to talk, something happening with them. You sure you want me hanging around? I, I can step out for a bit if you like. No, I'd prefer you stick around. Mm. Everyone I owe something to has got to hear this. I'm thinking about moving away. All right. I'm moving? Wait, what the fuck? It's just... Hell of a lot's happened this past year, you know? It's got me thinking about the future and how I still want to get back on the track team. That's why I want to move closer to a physical rehab facility, get my knee fixed up while going to school. At the earliest, all this is going to kick off starting next month. I see. That is quite sudden. It is. Hmm. On? 
Actually, I've got some news too. I'm in the middle of looking into studying abroad. Just short term. I've been wondering what would be the smartest move for my career, so... You're moving too. Both Haru and I are looking for places to live on our own. Starting next <laughs> month. In fact, our moves will probably occur around the same time as Ryuji's. I plan to keep learning about the business while also attending college. And that's why Mako-chan and I were talking about how we won't be able to get together like we used to. Hmm. Are you gonna tell them too? Um, so... I passed the entrance exam. I'm gonna be a high schooler starting in April. Fuck yeah. First high school, then college. Then I can finally research cognitive science for real. Just don't go off the deep end like, like Maruki did. Even you, Futaba? No, I apologize. I should be wishing you all the best Is he the only one staying here? Nah, you do have a point. We are going our separate ways. Oh, you mean the bonds we all have? <laughs> That's a great point. No, I mean the fucking fact that fucking we have cell phones and everything. It seems you're all taking great strides forward. I, however, will not be going anywhere until I've completed my current painting. No matter how many years it takes, I will express this feeling that's grown within me since we first banded together. That's still some kind of stride though, ain't it? No matter what we may go through, or how many times we may stumble, we'll follow the path we believe in. That's what the Phantom Thieves are all about. Oh yeah. Stop trying to be such a cool cat. I am not a cat. <laughs> Hold up. There's... Yeah, I guess I am. I don't know There's why. There's no way I'm about. accepting Doc's reality, but if it weren't for going through that, I don't know if I would have felt this way now. It's like following through with what I want to do in life. I guess I learned how to really believe in my future. <laughs> I I hope I hope they told Sojiro about what the fuck he went in through. In that case, wouldn't you say Sumire learned the same thing? I mean, she is at training camp right now. Yeah. Indeed. While her viewpoint may differ from the Phantom Thieves' beliefs, there's still much we can learn from her. Oh, that reminds me. Sumire left something with me. She told me she forgot to give us this the other day. Is it the paper? It is. Is that a newspaper clipping? Guess it was lying on the ground when we got out of Dr. Maruki's palace. This one's treasure. This article! It's the case about Dr. Maruki's loved one. The one whose family was murdered. I'd be willing to bet. This is Doc's treasure. So her case was the origin of Maruki's distortion. Would you hold on to this? We've all got to keep living with our eyes focused on our dreams. Otherwise, Dr. Maruki's gonna give us all kinds of shit. <laughs> You're absolutely right. Where is he? Well, I'm very impressed. You've all become quite mature. I've, we've seen some shit, dude. So let me throw you a little celebration in honor of the next chapters of your lives. Order whatever you'd like on me. Thank you. Oh yeah! It's all you can eat at... Oh. <laughs> Boss, thank you for the generosity. Uh, that wasn't what I said. Could you at least go easy on me? Everybody <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you guys want. Woohoo! Hey, oh, great yeah. cheese! Grab a Are we sushi? lucky? Sushi! Hello, sorry for missing you so late. I just wanted to send you a picture of the first shrimp visit of the year. Oh, yeah. Okay, so back, yeah, it was fucking a month ago. No, it's already been two months. I've uh, got a lot of mixed feelings about this picture, I guess. It's supposed to be me there, but it just isn't. It really makes me realize how bur a buried I was in Kasumi's identity. Now you're this. You're right, I'm not going to run away anymore. Actually, I've got one more photo I want you to see. J kind of embarrassing, but this is a photo my coach took of me, the real me, I guess. 
Training is tough, but it's really something, and it's really hard sometimes. Yeah, those are synonyms. What the fuck? But I feel like I'm finally moving forward with my life. So thanks to you, I'll make our dreams come true, and I'll do it as myself, not as to sue me. I'm climbing all the way to the top of the gymnastics world, so you can keep watching over me until then. Oh gosh, I'm cheering up for some reason. Falling apart at the slightest thing, I guess that means I really am back to being scary, right? Oh, uh, my break's over after you back to training. Mm. Sing on your own two feet now. We'll fight for our goals too. I'm too old to care. Oh yeah. Are you ready for tomorrow? Nope. <laughs> White day. That's tomorrow, right? You got some chocolates on Valentine's Day, didn't you? And white days when you return the favor. The men do the gifting. Oh. What's your plan? You've at least got some kind of present ready, right? Uh, <laughs> boss, help me. Mm, get it together, kid. Sometimes I don't know if you're fearless or just plain careless. Yes. Fine. Listen up, and I'll give you the recipe for the ultimate date. The chief has an ultimate date plan? I'd better listen in too, just in case. You're a cat. First off, you're gonna need a gift. This won't work without one. Can't go wrong with flowers. Just make sure you buy them before the date. You gotta present them near the end. Surprise her. So you can't let her see you buying them on the date. Got it? Huh. Gotta give them flowers, huh? I gotta take note. Next, think about where you're taking her. You gotta want somewhere with a right atmosphere. But it's gotta be peaceful. Oh, how about that new aquarium exhibit in Shinagawa? Just saw a commercial for it. Might be a good spot, right? The aquarium's a good place for a date. I see. Now, once the date part's over, you okay. gotta take her out to dinner. Somewhere nice, too. It's kinda last minute to make reservations. All the fancy places get booked pretty fast around White Day. Okay, right? I don't care what the cat says. <laughs> I'm screwed. <laughs> Damn it. I don't usually do this. Can't guarantee anything. I bet they're full up too. But you might get an edge if you mention my name. Wow, amazing. Chief has so to make Once you're at dinner, you get to talking, enjoying yourself. The flowers. Good. You were paying attention. It's the perfect time to surprise her. That ought to do it. Just follow the plan and you're safe. This plan is foolproof. Leave it to the chief. Well, I taught you my secrets. The rest is on you. Good luck. On that note, I'm going home. Go. Oh. You should start prepping right away. Don't waste the chief's advice, all right? Let's see. The reservation comes first. You remember that restaurant Chief told you about? Thank you for calling, sir. Were you looking to make a reservation? <laughs> Dinner for due tomorrow? I'm sorry, sir, but I'm afraid we're fully booked for tomorrow. White day is crazy, huh? But don't worry. All you You're a friend of Mr. Sakura's? My apologies, sir. If you could just hold for one moment. Thank you for your patience. You wanted a dinner course for two on the 14th. We will have a table ready for you. Dang. The chief has serious clout. This is not gonna end well. Could I ask your name and contact information? Okay. Your dinner plans are locked in. Now you just gotta get the flowers. And then it's off to the aquarium and dinner. It's gonna be busy tomorrow, so we'd better get rest while we can. I'm waiting to get rest. I need this fucking game to end.
Today's the day. Let's go get those flowers. I think there was a florist in that underground. Yeah, there is. <laughs> I was supposed to work for her. This. No, I think this is pretty. Well, how it is. Oh, what brings you here today? I see. Okay, leave it to me. Oh, she's voice. That should do it. I tried to keep it as simple as possible. Okay, that comes out to. Hold on. Let me cover this one. You've been taking. I need to express a. Good luck! Okay, now you're all ready for the date. You know who you plan on in. Don't worry, I'm a gentleman who knows his man. Alright? What the fuck? Gee, I wonder who. What? Something wrong? Shinagawa? Why? Well, I guess that's a stupid question. I'm at work, but I can take off early. I'll see you there. Are you serious? I should head there. Yep. You know, some studies suggested aquariums are good for relieving anxiety. Now that I'm actually in one, I think I get what they're saying. You know what I mean. I'm having a nice time. And having my little guinea pig here definitely doesn't hurt. Never would have guessed I'd be going on aquarium dates at my age. Kind of nice, though. I get that feeling a lot with you. Pretty hard to get used to. Thank you, by the way, for returning the favor in your own way. Oh, yeah? I'm looking forward to it. Let's see if you can surprise me. I think I've seen enough fish for one day. So, what now? Oh, really? Then let's see this place. This is gonna end in failure. Wow, it's actually worked. This is a little more than I expected. <laughs> yeah, in a way. It's my first time coming here with someone I'm actually into, so... Just when I think he can't surprise me anymore. My guinea pig somehow keeps outdoing himself. A guy like you is wasted on me, you know. It's a real tragedy. <laughs> I didn't mean to go fishing for that, but thanks. Sorry, one second. <laughs> what should I get rid of gift? Sorry about that. Ladies and gentlemen, Thank you for joining us on this special day. We wish you all an unforgettable evening with one last finishing touch from us. Hmm? Uh oh. Wow. <laughs> what? <laughs> Thank you. How the fuck is I hiding this? A starry cityscape and roses, huh? Don't you think that's a little much? No, it's fine. Really? Not at all? I can't even tell if that's sarcasm. That's something I've always liked about you. It's never just about you. You always go to these crazy lengths to make other people happy. I know. I've been shot in the head for it. I really admire that. And I guess I've been trying to learn from it. Makes me think I gotta work on myself a little before I deserve you. Sweet thing to say. Well, after all this effort, I should at least return the favor somehow. Maybe my guinea pig has a suggestion? <laughs> I'll be kind from that one. Hey, you're finally taking off tomorrow. Sojiro said you don't have to help out here today. Go and see your friends before you leave. <laughs> There's no need to go happy. Off you go then. Try not to cry. All right. Um. Oh, fuck. 
saying goodbye to me? Cut it out. Just remember to pack once. I don't want you forgetting anything. All right. Oh, yeah. I forgot about this. I'm surprised you kept a log this whole time. Thanks, though. I'll keep it safe. Still, a lot has happened. After yeah. all, you had quite the side job. Just behave once you're home, okay? Shouldn't you be saying your goodbyes? Go on. I can't believe you're going home to, uh, tomorrow. I'm sure it'll be. I'm sure it'll be lonely. Even after we're dead and gone, we'll still be the Phantom Thieves, right? Yeah. Hey. Oh, I got a notification on your phone. Who's it from? Aiming tomorrow. Should stop by the clinic. I have some good news. I want to see it. I'll do it. Sure, hopefully this doesn't hey, it's that pompous jackass. You came. I wanted to update you on Miwa-chan. Her symptoms subsided thanks to the new medicine. Fuck she yeah. still has some way to go, but it won't be too long until I get to see her smile. It wasn't by my efforts alone. I wouldn't have been able to finish the new medicine without your help. Yeah, we did some shady Thank shit. Thank you so much, my little guinea pig. Oh, I guess I can't call you that now that you've helped me so much. Same goes for the situation with Oyamata. You did everything you could to help me with it. I don't know where all that devotion comes from. Maybe I should take a cue from you. Here, I want you to have this. God thanks. So, here today, gone tomorrow, huh? Now, I'm just a neighborhood doctor. No more assistant. Wonder if it's gonna be rough without you. Well, the thought crossed my mind. But somehow, I think we'll be fine. And hey, if I feel like it, I can always surprise you with a house call. Look after yourself out there, all right? Not just for your own sake. Cool, does anyone else fucking send me that? Nope. You look like you're doing well. I decided to stop by after work. I used to come by this area on occasion. I was always a fan of LeBlanc's coffee. It's tomorrow, right? The day you go home? Yep. We're talking about the mastermind behind the world-renowned Phantom Thieves. Give me some credit. On the record, you've been cleared of all the crimes you were accused of. Unfortunately, the stigmas that came with them are a little harder to simply wipe away. You might find that even now, Sometimes it'll feel like the whole world's against you. So, just in case, take this. Whenever you need help, I'll be on your side. Remember that. I'll be doing my part to bring some real justice to our legal system. Can't rely on the Phantom Thieves forever. Nope. Where the fuck's Mira? You're finally heading home tomorrow, huh? I guess this means the Phantom Thieves have disbanded. My documentary script is going well, though. It's not really close to done, but it's coming along. Christmas trilogy, right? Wait, we're making this a series? I don't know if it'll be that big of a deal, but if I actually get this done, I guess it'd be a waste to stop at one. Makes me wonder how many people I can reach with my work. It's exciting, but kind of scary, too. It might be a bestseller, or it might just fade into obscurity. But I want to put my hope into this. It's a message from the old me to everyone in the world. So, even if I'm scared of failing, I'll face this head on. Just like you did with that first calling card. Oh, yeah. It's still a pretty early draft, but... It'd mean a lot if you could read it sometime. I could really use your feedback. You probably had tons of crazy fights I don't even know about, right? Oh, okay. So we should you sit down and it. talk about them sometime. The more of it I get on record, the better. I'll make sure the story of the Phantom Thieves goes down in history. Hmm. 
Oh, you're way freezing. Oh, hell yeah. The fuck? Party. What the fuck am I doing? He's a trickster. What the fuck is this dude? Does the lawyer and still prosecute him? Hey, you're moving tomorrow, right? Don't forget to practice at home! If you visit, you gotta call me, okay? We can play in person again, or wait! Oh man, if your hometown has an arcade, I could totally do an away match there! Oh right! I returned the money, and he forgave me. Okay. We're friends now, and he's even playing gun about with me. He's still a total newbie. So I'm teaching him all the pro strats. Oh, but don't stress. It's not all boot camp this time. I'm going easier on him. Thanks for everything. You've helped me so much. I'm gonna give you my secret weapon. See, that's my strategy. I use this to practice at home. But these days I'm kind of too busy helping mom or playing with my friends. At first, I thought you were kind of weird, but... Uh. Now, uh... You seem pretty cool. So, I'm still your teacher when it comes to games, but you're my teacher in real life. Hell yeah. When I collect the rest of all of these, I'll do them all. I think she gives you a show me, please. Oh, you came to visit. You're going home tomorrow, correct? To tell you the truth, I have an important shogi tournament tomorrow as well. Thank you very much. If I do well, that will make it 10 straight wins. I'll work hard so I can give you a good report. That's quite Hell a yeah. smile. Like a knight standing victorious at the end of a grand siege. But I suppose a knight can't remain idle for too long. His presence is still needed elsewhere, I take it. If my shogi skills have truly helped such a dauntless champion, then it has been an honor and a pleasure. From one player to another, I have a parting gift for you. The lance piece moves exclusively forward. Until it is promoted, it can only move onward, never back. So let us continue on our own paths, even if we have to part ways for now. One day, when the two of us lances have been promoted, we will retrace our steps and meet again. Fuck yeah. It is nice being at the end, honestly. Train doors are now closing. Please stand back. Oh, what a coincidence. It's not a coincidence I make sure I got here. I was just getting some of my college enrollment papers ready. Soon enough, I'll be living on my own, too. <laughs> New beginnings for both of us, I suppose. <laughs> a little. We've been seeing each other so often, after all. But once things calm down... We can all meet up again. My sister and I are actually going to look at my new place soon. A year ago, all this would have been unthinkable for me. Yeah. Nobody told me to do this. It's a path I chose for myself. If I'd never met you and stayed a simple honor student, I'd never have realized I had that choice. So, I want you to have this. It helped me learn to love studying one day. I'll be a police commissioner. I know it won't be easy, but I also know I'll never give up. By giving this to you, I want to prove that. We fought back together, so it seems only fair you keep it. I want you to know that you're an irreplaceable comrade to me. Always have been, always will be. I'm just gonna fucking cheese this.
Uh, Tony, he's gonna be back again. It's crazy, sounds like he's gonna be busy with rehab once he's all set up moving. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're being, they're not like assholes, but I'm, okay, I don't care that much. See it. I just figured they'd say something about him. Oh, what a coincidence. I'm about to give a lecture. Did you come to see the campus? You're going back home tomorrow, right? Make sure you keep up your studies there, okay? Of course. And let me know if there's anything you need. This is the last time we'll see each other for a while. You can at least look a little sad about it. I'm kidding. Honestly, seeing you so happy gives me peace of mind. Now that you're heading out into the world, I've got a present for you. Oh, yeah. It sounds like the setup to a joke. A student bumps into his teacher in a full French maid outfit. But somehow, that opened up all kinds of new paths in my life. You taught me so much. You're not just my best student. You were a great master. I can make up for all the times I distanced myself from my students. I'll help anyone who needs it. The point is, I'll put in the work. I learned a lot from you, and I won't let that go to waste. Hmm. Looks like six more. Somehow the credits of this game aren't that fucking long. What? Focus. Oh, it's exactly as the card said. You came to visit me. In your current state, you should be fine. But please be sure to relax once you're home, or to make up for all the hard work you did here. I've been receiving encouragement from my clients lately, even though I should be the one encouraging them. Strange, isn't it? But perhaps that's the truest form of fortune-telling there is. Mutually encouraging each other to find happiness in a world full of tangled, painful fates. The kind of comfort I've always hoped to provide in my readings. Here, this card represents your future. Please, take it as a good luck charm. An upright fortune card represents happiness to come, but it's an omen of doom when reversed. But I know you'll carry on with the same conviction you've always had. You were never one to fear the future. That's how you managed to bring joy to any fate. So, I'm sure we'll meet again. Though, that's not based on any augury. Just a personal wish. Just that one person. That's unfair. Oh, honey. We do not talk like this. I need to talk to her. Do you have ESP? I'm surprised you knew where I was. Are you here to say goodbye? I don't, but I'm pretty sure the fortune teller down the street does. You can hang out with her. Oh, thanks. I wanted to speak with you about something, too. So, I'm close to being able to report on Kaio's case. Ever since all that stuff happened with Shido, the stories haven't stopped rolling in. But it looks like I can finally avenge her. And it's all thanks to your hard work. Here. It's a record of the struggles we shared. <laughs> you don't By the way, I heard the Phantom Thieves are disbanding? It's gonna be so boring around here. Not every day you get to chase after a bunch of young revolutionaries like them. Hold on, though. I bet you got more tricks up your sleeve. You're going home, not turning over a new leaf. I'll be keeping an ear out for your next adventure, okay? I promise, I'll tell your story to the world. You're gonna have to fight with the uh, what's his name on that one. Fuck it no. Oh. Okay. That's right. You'll be departing tomorrow. It's sad to see this as a season of farewells, but I didn't expect we'd all go our separate ways. <laughs> it's been hell of a year. That's putting it mildly. This time last year, I'd never have imagined I'd meet you all, leave my home, or become a phantom thief. The phantom thing wasn't a thing a year ago. Do you remember the painting I submitted to that competition? Desire and hope it was. Well, I would like to bestow it upon you as a parting gift. 
Oh yeah. As of now, my canvas is still blank. It's not for lack of inspiration. There's so much I want to express, I can barely contain my passion. But my heart has not led me astray yet. I'll paint as it guides me. Even should I scar my work with doubt, hesitation, chaos. Certainly, that's a beauty all its own. Your life is no worse for its own scars. Your truest beauty lies in them. And I hope you tell me their story someday. Oh, okay, I know where Howard was at. Hold up. I got very confused, but I know exactly what that. Oh, did you come here for souvenirs? This place has everything. I'm busy getting ready for my study abroad, too. Gotta research schools, places to live. But we're all splitting off to do our own thing, huh? Honestly, it's not really hitting me yet. I mean, it makes sense. We stuck with each other through all the freaky stuff last year. By the way, um... A little girl stopped me the other day in Shibuya. I think that skull's staring into my soul. She said she saw me in magazines. And that she wants to be just like me when she grows up. It felt incredible. Oh, right. Vague did a special piece on me in this month's issue. Oh, yeah. I said it all in the interview, but... I'm gonna work hard. One day, I'll be modeling across the world. I've gotta reach people. I wanna give someone hope, like you did for me. Thank you for all you've done. The days I spent with you were some of the brightest in my life. Once I'm a star, I'm gonna shine even brighter, though. So you watch out for me! Yo! Man, spring break's supposed to be the most fun part of the year, but instead you're just moving away. Then again, so am I. I guess this is probably the last time we'll be meeting up here. Yeah. Don't even have to ask. I was already gonna do that. Spring break is gonna be boring as hell anyway. Wait a sec. Your hometown isn't near the countryside, is it? I was just thinking it'd be great to run and train somewhere out where it's all big, nature -y open space. Honestly, even with the rehab, I don't know if my leg's ever going to be how it was before. But when I think about how much I want to run, well, I figure there's no point lying to myself. Nothing's guaranteed. I don't know if I'm going to get anywhere, but well, you could say that for any goal, right? I don't want to live stuck on regrets or shame. I, I'd rather just run and keep on running. Oh, yeah. And hey, you better practice too. See, if we share our times, we can even compete from far away. Man... I think about going to school without you guys. I don't know. I can't imagine it. It's nice feeling like I got a future worth looking forward to for once, though. And it's all thanks to you, man. Oh, wait. I can only be fucking easy. walk out this door. I th is Howard the last one? Yeah, I guess I talked to Haru and the game's over with. meeting here. And that reminds me, the new coffee shop venture is progressing toward opening its first location. Actually, I'll be involved with its launch even while attending college. Hell yeah. We do have plans to expand into other regions. Perhaps one may pop up in your town. From now on, I'll have to balance my studies and the company. No easy task, I'm sure. But it's all for the sake of making my dream come true. I swear I'll make this work. By the way, I tried making something for you. Oh yeah. I'd like to sell handcrafted goods at my cafe as well. So this is the first step in my practice. I want to live up to my grandfather's reputation after all. And my father's legacy. It has to be a comforting, welcoming place for everyone. Some place to spend your peaceful hours. Once it opens, we should all meet up there. Just like our days at Leblanc.
for the last time this game. I think there are a few people you haven't said goodbye to yet. Are you sure you want to head home? Are you really sure? God damn it. Hey, um, I actually have a... Even when I was human, I kept holding on to this for some reason. Between a cat, a human, or some kind of vehicle. It's been hard to say for sure who or what I am, but whatever else I am, I can say without a doubt, I'm your partner. Well then, we should probably go home and get packed, huh? You finished saying your goodbyes? Well, how'd it go? Did it make you feel like you want to stay? I see. I guess you did almost die. Plus, whatever other crazy stuff I don't know about. Oh, whoa, whoa. I almost died multiple times. You're leaving early tomorrow from Shibuya, right? Make sure you pack up before you head to sleep. Oh, and take that stupid cat with you. I don't want it getting lost and ending up back here. <laughs> don't make fun of me. I can go wherever I want all by myself. <sighs> it really never stops meowing, huh? Hey, Futaba. What's he saying? Is he sad that he has to leave me? He said, Sojiro stupid. <laughs> what? What kind of translation is that? Let me have a nice goodbye. <laughs> Mona's your responsibility now. Leave Sojiro to me. <laughs> Mona's been my responsibility since day one. Like, day three. Alright, I've been counted on. Oh, man. Even if you're not here, I'll make sure I do my best. So, you go do your best, too. <sighs> Thank you for everything. Hey, you got everything? I do. I took you in. I thought I was the one helping you. But it turns out it was the other way around. Take care. Don't be so cheeky. Oh, and sorry. I wanted to have Futaba see you off too. I haven't been able to find her since this morning though. Same with that cat. If you end up back in the city, come on by. I'll at least treat you to a nice cup of coffee. Wait, that means I can't go closing this door, huh? <laughs> what are you doing? Hurry up and go. Yeah. You plan on closing this door? The time would never allow it. to be parked right there <laughs> after we said hmm? we disband we are all in break after all no more entrance exams mm. I can drive you to the station you really really gotta go <gasps> shit <laughs> they've even followed us here mm. what should we do Need a hand? Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> Dr. Maruki? You're suggesting uh -huh. we split up? <laughs> Should we? <laughs> <laughs> God forbid someone say a fucking word. Here we go! Bye! Come and get us! <laughs> <laughs> Shall we then?
There's no charge. Oh? If you find yourself struggling in life, you can start over, like me. Remember that. So yeah, if that ends up saving you, then we're square. Jesus Christ. Good luck. So what about Rumi? Damn, man. Those dudes just wouldn't give up. Wish it went smoother, but hmm? I guess this is it. Be sure to eat well. We'll see you. Soon, right? If you don't come back, we'll find you there. Hmm? All right, it's time. Yeah. Aw, gotta go already? We don't make the train schedule. See you later, my dude! I'll text you, okay? Come on, sit down. <laughs> what the hell? The original. Oh. Hey, uh. Oh, hey. You taught me to keep my head up, didn't you? <laughs> Told you I was coming with you. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Take care. In the original, uh. They just drive run home. He doesn't get on a train. There's something no, obviously it's it's been almost a year since I started this. Um, and even even knowing the original game and going through everything. This is without a doubt one of the best games I have ever played. Honestly, one of the few games where I can. Oh, it's Mona. <laughs> I would just ask for help. It's one of the few games. I the game very heavily like beats you over the fucking head with its themes and its ideas and its messaging. Its message, but I, I, they're very important messages, honestly. It's a game I'm glad I picked up. Um, I, I've technically bought this game three fucking times. But... I, I guess we're just gonna let the credits go. And see if there's anything at the end.
I, I, I will be doing Scramble when it comes out, also. Because it's an extension of the story. I don't know if it's an extension of the story. I don't know how, how royal fits about that. Away are some of the greatest fucking songs ever thrown into a video game. But, like, like I said during it, I, I've heard those two songs multiple times. And just hearing them in the context of what the game has instead of just randomly yeah, uh, off the CD kind of brings them really together. And what I like about it is it's a call to response to those songs. So I, I think it I think it's out of order thematically. The way I see it, throw your mask away is Maruki's giving the proposal of what you don't need to do this anymore. This, you can stop this, and I believe this Joker's response to that. Of, we still need to do what we believe in, regardless of what you believe in. Um, I think that's the whole document of giving the protagonist is such a shift for this game because all the other protagonists all the other antagonists um, Kamoshido uh, Shido Madarame they're all like these over the top villains who are like evil for the sake of being evil because you need you need evil people to go against in this game. And then Maruki is not evil. He's not this grandiose narcissist. He's a guy who's been through some shit. Who just thinks he's doing what is right to help people. And at the end of the day, it, it's a battle of ideology at the end. Which is such a from how a lot of media is. There is no good person in that in the end game. There's no bad person. It's literally a fight of differing ideas of how to move on from trauma. a hell of a game, and I think everyone should play the Royal Prison. I can't think of... I can't think of how um, original persona. They had two different people do. They had two different people do localization. Or did I just read that wrong? This is gonna be weird going from this into Strikers, because there's no way in hell Strikers is, is such a. I, I know very little about Strikers. There's no way Strikers is this.
like existential game at the end. I don't I don't think it I don't think it can have that that type of you know I've also never heard the song. It doesn't seem like it's nice. It's an amazing song, but like... Granted, I'm sure if I fuck it up, I'd be like, oh, it's such a fitting song, so I'm not going to do that. Um, yeah, how do you get... I don't know how you... I don't know how you change, how you, how you went up with, uh, this in Strikers. Strikers seems like such a, like, up, Strikers seems like Persona 5 without, like, any of the serious shit, which, again, I haven't seen, I've only seen the ads, maybe that game is fucking horrible when it comes to existentialism, but, I don't know. He just missed a catchy. <sighs> it's almost like he knows. He knows he missed something. <sighs> that was fucking cool. Hmm. Hell yeah. 